Hi guys, welcome to Nana's Corner. My channel is all about learning to DIY, craft, and cook without spending a lot of money. If that's what you're looking for, be sure to subscribe and then click on the bell when it appears so you won't miss when I upload something new. And if you enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up to let me know you'd like to see more. Hi guys, today I'm at my Nana's house and I'm making Valentine's Day love bugs for my class today and here's a snip of it and I was playing with my toy so I got this. <laughs> and we made love bugs indeed. We made 40 of them, but we had a lot of fun doing it. For this project, you'll need a fruit cup, jello cup, pudding cup, whichever you like, pipe cleaners, pom-poms, wiggly eyes, and hearts for the feet. You can cut these out of paper, or you can get table scatter in the shape of hearts at the Dollar Tree. First, you take the pipe cleaner and you cut it in half. And this is something that your young child can help you with. My granddaughter up in the corner was having so much fun cutting them and then twirling them around the pencil. They don't have to be perfect. Let them go to town. In fact, the kookier they are, the cuter the love bug. Once you have the antenna coiled, then you just take your glue gun and you attach a pom-pom to the end of each one. We tried with the tacky glue, but it just didn't work out too well. You just had to wait too long for it to actually stick. So I suggest using the glue gun. This is a real fun project to do with kids. They come out so cute, and I think her classmates are gonna really love them. Next, you're gonna glue the antennas onto the back of the Jello cup. Once again, the glue gun works better for this. So this is something that maybe you can do at the end if you're making them with your child. I left a straight piece so that it would be easier to attach. And then once you have the antennas on, all you're going to do now is glue on the eyes and the pom-pom nose. You'll see for my granddaughter up in the corner, we, I used tacky glue. I squeezed it on where I needed the eyes to go, and then she placed the Google eyes on. Now, if you do use the tacky glue, you want to set the pudding cup or jello cup on its side for a little bit so that the eyes can uh, stick real well because sometimes they'll slide down if they haven't attached very well. And the last thing you put it, do is put on the feet. If you're doing it with a glue gun, you just put some glue gun on, glue on the hearts, stick the jello cup on top, and you're done. And up above, you'll see we modified again. We put the tacky glue on top, and then my granddaughter stuck on the feet. And they came out just so cute. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video and don't forget to subscribe.